here at the Dirt Car Northeast Fall Nationals, the Brockville, Ontario Speedway. I'm Greg Kelman, standing here with Mod Light driver Dan Ferguson. He's the Canadian Modified Champion of the Brighton Speedway for the last three seasons. But Dan, you purchased a Mod Light. You've had a couple of chances to get the car out on the track, but you're here on a home soil at the Brockville Speedway, a chance uh, to show your wares in the Mod Light. Yeah, not really home soil. I think we've only raced here uh, three or four times uh, in the Sportsman and uh, the Street Stock once. So uh, today should be a should be a neat uh, experience. There's a lot of good cars here tonight, so uh, so we'll see what we can do. We'll start off with the Mod Light. What led to you purchasing this car from the Slater family, and and uh, how have you liked it so far? Well, I. I We've been to Dirt Week a few times and watched them, and we always think that they go really good at Burton. And uh, you know, it's just one of those things that uh, I've never raced before. So I thought, you know, why not get one? And we could travel around a little bit more than uh, than what we can do with the modified from Brighton because um, we can't take it anywhere. So uh, so it's a good thing to uh, to get into, I think. Now uh, the modified, obviously, as you say. Uh, it's a, a, a home track type of deal where that's the only place they run it, but you're committed to that as well. You've got a very strong program built there with great sponsorship, and obviously with the championships racking up, you don't want to ruin a good thing there either. Yeah, exactly. We'll, we'll be back at Brighton again next year. This car here, we're not too sure what we're going to do yet, if we're going to sell it or, uh, or keep it. It's hard to say right now, but uh, it's definitely hard to get, uh, to get sponsors on board to go when you're racing all over the place. So it's uh, so it's two totally different ball games between this and the modified. But uh, but this is a lot of fun to do this. Now uh, some have said that the mod lights are an affordable way to get in. What's your take on the mod lights? Uh, having just run it for a handful of races, uh, is this something that you find affordable, or is it uh, the Canadian mod maybe a better budget for you? Uh, the, the modified's definitely a better budget for me, just because of where we are. Um, you know, the the car doesn't cost a whole lot of money to buy up front. Um, and it's only 20 minutes away <laughs> to, to tow, right? Where with with this car here, we've, we've spent twice as much money into this car already. <laughs> and uh, we have to drive, you know, two or three hours to get to the to the next closest racetrack. So, uh, so this here, it's just more or less a for fun thing. <laughs> it's definitely not a money maker, that's for sure. <laughs> Now, Brighton this year in the Canadian Modified, you had a great battle all season long with Zeke McHugh, and that was quite a fight you two had. And somehow you pulled out the championship at the end of the year and, and kept the crown in your side. Yeah, it was uh, it was quite a battle there. At the first, we thought, you know, what can, what can we do to keep up with him at least? And then uh, and then we just had a good uh, a good run there for a couple weeks. I think we won three or four features in a row, and then that really put us back in the hunt and. Uh, you know, it was just consistent finishes every week, and then uh, just worked out at the end that that's where we ended up. So, uh, so I was happy with that. You have a fantastic marketing program with your Canadian Modified. Who would you like to thank for the support in 2012? Uh, just Mark Heating and Cooling. They're they're the main guys. Uh, can't say enough about them. Uh, we had uh, DMD Truck and Equipment Services come on board this year. They're new to the sport completely. Uh, Mark's Barbershop back again. Uh, Gross Construction, the Wellington Dental Center, uh, Scott's Haulage, Lakeshore Farms, Ronnie B's Car Sales. Um, I don't know. There's a whole bunch of other ones that I'm probably missing, but uh, those are the main ones that we like to keep happy. There you go. That's Dan Ferguson here getting ready for the Dirt Car Northeast Fall Nationals, the Mod Light Edition, coming up this afternoon here. I'm Greg Kellen from the Brockville, Ontario Speedway.